How much froth is my hardcore Iron Man which cannot leave PvP worlds? The account got one major goal and that is obtaining an infernal cape. This series could end at any point and the current bounty is on screen. Good luck gamers. And we're gonna start off this video with a barrel's chest with absolutely nothing in it. Kill count 18, I still have zero items. But I hope in this episode we can change that. Yeah, perfect, nothing. Okay, one more chest, just one. Oh my God, we got a double chest. The Darrock King, it's two useless items, but we got two items, a double chest as our first chest. What a good start to the video. And if we would like to, we can high alt this for 180k. I don't think these items are gonna be useful for me at all, but I'm extremely happy. I don't know if you guys are familiar with my old PvP hardcore Iron Man, but it took me 146 barrels chests until I got my first item, which was a Carol's Coif. So getting these two pretty bad items early on is a blessing, a huge blessing for me. All right, I'm extremely happy. This could be the back to back potentially. Never lucky, man. As y'all can see, I still don't have any Saradon and Bruce, and my easiest way to obtain Saradon and Bruce is by killing under Druids for grubby keys. Y'all know that already. I don't have to repeat myself every single week. Alright, there we go, our first grubby key. We're just gonna open it straight away, hope for the Bruce. We got it. We actually got the Bruce. 13 kill count, 13 grubby chests have been opened and we got ourselves 6 doses of Cerebrus. This is massive, it's actually a good episode. I got Barrow's items, I got brews. I'm so excited, I'm s this is gonna be a great week. So now that we have brews, we will have to permanently have a restore in our inventory at all time. So in the last episode I completed Fairy Tale Part 1 and one thing I didn't realize is that I can actually start using fairy rings if I start this quest. So we're just gonna, I should be able to teleport. There we go. Yep, we can now use the fairy teleports. Another thing have been unlocked and now I'm really tired. All right, I got low on bolts. I made some uh, meter bolts. 57 uh, smithing, 56 fletching. Oh my God, someone's here. Why was he waiting there? He's not gonna be here again, right? Oh shit, he saw me. Look, he's running out. Oh my, I see him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is he doing? Okay, I, I'm gonna get my rainers another day, another time. This gotta be his scout. Oh my god. Jesus, full ancestrals. Yeah, Doja's cat. I gotta be careful for Doja's cat. I saw this group Iron Man training on crabs while I was doing a bird out run, and I tried to kill him, but I failed. Every time I get the opportunity to kill these gang bosses, I, I take them. So much experience, so much loot. All right, we got three more books, all going to hit points. Oh, this is gonna be, give me a level. Seventh one hit points, beautiful, with the book. We finally got our Rainers. Took me a while. Oh no, I forgot my magic sorceries. All right, let's do some Slayer task. Crawling hands. And that's gonna be task one, completed. Task number two. Completed. Three completed. We got 48 Slayer from killing these rats. Task number four completed. And that's another task completed. Task number six completed. Another task completed. Completed. 39 completed. Uh, give us a good task, Connor. Lizardman in the Lizardman Canyon. I couldn't have asked for a better task. That's beautiful. Wait, my slave task is in the Lizardman Canyon. Where's that? Oh, I can't do the slave task here. Oh, the PK is here. The PK from Mount Cadom is here. Is he gonna come inside? Hi. Is he gonna die? Look at him. How you doing? This guy is actually on mobile. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay, he can definitely not kill me in on mobile, right? A big level coming up here. 75 range. And there we go, 49 Slayer. There it is, the final kill. Another 90 points given to this account. We now have 271 points. And I still don't know what I'm gonna use it on. All right, I'm going to do something completely unpredictable. I'm gonna close my eyes, scroll this quest line, and just pick a random quest. All right, here we go. 
3, 2, 1. Okay, we are doing Sogre Flesh Eaters. I have so much weird stuff in my inventory during this quest. And this should be the Sogre Flesh Eater completed. We got some nice skills, uh, no level up. All right, now that Sogre Flesh Eaters is done, there's actually a second quest in this quest line. Um, rum deal. Let's say theoretically speaking, if someone were to tell block me here, what's even my escape? Quests have been completed, 7k prayer experience, 7k fishing, 7k farming, and a level 54 fishing, beautiful. All right, so there's actually another quest in this quest line, cabin fever, and I just happen to have all the requirements for it, so we're gonna continue. All right, I hate cutscenes, but this should be the quest completed. As long as no one's waiting outside, I should be fine. I don't know where I spawn. I haven't looked into this. All I know is I'm scared. I'm very scared of cutscenes. Okay, thank God no one's here. Yep, there we go. Quest have been completed and no one's out here. Thank God. So the most interesting part about completing this quest is that we can now kill cave horrors. We still need 58 Slayer for that, but we have unlocked the island. We can actually kill them. No way. He's here. He, he like I was watching my temple and he he's it was recently updated. I had to log middle of the quest and he pretty much knew. Oh yeah, from this quest we got crafting experience, so now I am 58 crafting. And from the quest we also got ourselves... Wait for it, wait for it. Alright, wait for it. 58 agility. Mage training arena. I hate this place, but I just know I gotta do it, so here I am. Oh, there's someone in here. Does that mean I have to go? I should probably just run. Um, I can teleport, but hunt the PvP. What's even that gear? I'm in desperate need for cosmic runes in May Training Arena, and they only have 20 in each world. And I only have three worlds to pick from, so I've been here for hours just hopping between the worlds, buying the cosmic up. But I think we should have enough now. 612. <laughs> he doesn't know the safe zone. <laughs> I'm teasing that noob. I am teasing Danub. Look at that, 77 magic. All right, this is gonna be the last point I need for now. 2010 points. Now we can actually unlock a new item for me, which happens to be the Bones to Peaches spell. We're gonna do this quick. Bones to Peaches, unlock. All right, with this spell, look at this. So we can now use the Bones to Peaches. We get a food source. The Bones of Peaches spell is gonna be super useful for whenever I get a Mage's Book and a Master Wand from the Mage Training Arena. But they also have a secret plan for this spell, which I'm not gonna tell you guys. Alright, I'm getting a level as well, 48 Prayer and 7-7 seven, seven Combat. Oh my god, there was a lot of people in Valley. Yeah, I'm not going there. So I need to get my construction up, but I cannot tell you why. But that's 52 construction. 53 construction. I decided to do another slay task, 41 task completed. Wouldn't it be great if I ended this video with a barrels item? 3, 2, 1, good luck. Never ever lucky. One thing you should never do on a PvP hard crime is to use a unique teleport in front of a potential scout. However, sometimes I just think it's fun. I'm using up these dual rings quicker than anything else, so I think I'm just gonna make a hundred of them right now. What the hell? Who was that waiting for me? Oh my god. What was that gear? He looked stacked. The, this could potentially be an upgraded level 57 fletching. We can now make maple shields. And as soon as we get 62 crafting, we can make green dehyde maple shields. And uh, that's gonna give me extra magic defense bonus. Great for avoiding tail blocks. Before we end today's episode, I feel like I need to clear something up. There is a rumor going around. Maybe it's just a rumor from five people. I'm not sure. But the rumor says that I have shucked the entire PvP hardcore I am in bounty. And I just want to say, uh, nope, I have not. I still have the 8 billion. I just don't have it on this account because in case I get scammed or hacked or something, uh, I, I need to keep this money safe so it's not on this account ever uh, but no i have not shucked it and the bounty is still 8 billion and 55 million 
But now I need to get ready for leaks, it's starting in a few days and I gotta get prepared. But two hardcore iron videos in two weeks, not too bad I must say. The Hopefully you guys are happy with this video as well, so if we can get 5000 likes that would be amazing, thank you, goodbye.